Let's talk about uh, Lehman Brothers. Our Charlie Gasparina reporting that Lehman was weighing the sale of its prized Newberger Berman asset management business more than two weeks ago. Charlie's back now to talk more about the implications for the future of its CEO, Dick Fold and Lehman itself as an independent entity. Charlie? How are you doing, Bill? Uh, the big news isn't what you're reading in the paper, obviously, today, about uh, Newberger and Berman possibly being sold or the investment management division of Newberger being sold uh, to private equity firms. We reported that more than two weeks ago. The bigger news is the future of Lehman Brothers and also the future of its CEO, Dick Fold. Obviously, with all the losses, the write-downs, the raising of capital is a major speed bump in uh, Dick Fold's career. He is the longest-running uh, CEO. Uh, but sources tell CNBC that Fold has been handing more and more of the day-to-day -day responsibilities to his number two, the recently named president, Bart McDade. There is a huge question inside Lehman right now whether this is just a division of labor. It's a new firm. It's a new, new, uh, new conditions out there, very difficult market conditions. Or is, whole, or is Fold prepping his successor, uh, possibly stepping down as, as chairman uh, within the next couple of months, excuse me, stepping down as CEO and uh, remaining as chairman while uh, Bart McDade gets a CEO? Uh, we, we don't know that right now. I can tell you that there are, there are people inside that are very loyal. Fold says he's firmly in charge and that this is just natural. This is just handing over responsibilities more and more of the responsibilities that Fold, they concede that Fold is handing over more of the responsibilities that he used to do to Bart McDade, uh, his number two, uh, but they're saying it's just a, a, a division of labor, but there are people inside that say this is more than a, a subtle change and that this kind of pre, pre this is a prelude to, to the future of, of, of Fold possibly stepping out as, as CEO. The other question is, will Lehman uh, remain independent? And, you know, like I said, the bigger story today is not that they may spin off part of Newberg or, or most of it. I'm hearing that they could spin off a, spin off a huge part. But what, well, what this means for the future of Lehman Brothers, and one of the reasons why Lehman was considered before the credit crunch occurred, before relatively recent, the, one of the best investment banks out there, is that they were a diversified firm. They were not Bear Stearns. They, did not, they weren't a one-trick pony where they traded or they just invested in, uh, in, these, uh, in these exotic instruments, uh, these subprime mortgages, that they did investment banking, and yes, they they had a very good money management firm in the name of Newberg and Berman. When you start selling pieces of that stuff off, particularly uh, stuff that works like Newberg and Berman, uh, a lot of people, and I'm talking about a lot of CEOs at other firms, are really questioning whether Lehman can survive as a private entity going forward. And uh, that's really what's in the market right now, whether Dick Fold uh, survives as CEO. Like I said, his people in there say, you know, if he's handing over, they, they concede he is handing over more responsibility, but it's all, it's just a division of labor. Uh, and whether uh, Lehman survives as a, as an independent firm in the future. And uh, I guess we'll know in the next couple of months. Guys, I guess back so. To you. All right, Charlie. Good job. Thanks. Okay. We'll see you later.